Welcome friends, this is Anish for you and you are going for a legendary journey. We are going for the Black Forest and the Black Forest offer us copper, tin, and bronze and lot more. We are going to a, a talking about total bronze age and Black Forest guide. So stay tuned for more exciting news. So um, the storm actually uh, stopped very quickly. I think it was going to be dramatic. So we finally go to our uh, location or our destination. If you're new, uh, if you doesn't have any um, uh, sub base at um, or near Black Forest, then you should make a um, sub base at quite good looking sub base because um, here it is. Uh, next morning so we are going to talk about um, a lot of stuff here so what you need what you doesn't need right now what you can build or it is actually very life-changing moments for new player because um, <coughs> black forest is very very important and uh, it unlocks a lot of items so first of all we're going to look for these uh, these items uh, these um, coal, okay, this charcoal keen, and uh, this one actually records uh, circling growth five and uh, other the stone, uh, nothing else. And these uh, smelter also need uh, five circling growth. So, first, our goal is um, collect some copper and find some circling core, uh, get some tin, make some uh, bronze make some armor or weapon whatever you need right now also we're going for this black forest and uh, those people actually welcome party so kill those um, uh, I, I don't know this greyhound is very bad so um, they're actually they they're very happy to see me a long time ago so they're trying to uh, hug me in a, in a certain way but i don't want to so you can see I already died here previously. So there is a good memory, nice memory. Uh, so we're just uh, entering the black forest and there it is, our big guy is there. So these uh, blue giants are named as troll and they are trolling us. And obviously if you had a chance, first kill those monster because those are actually very sneaky and then uh, they can uh, come back later um, and then with those greyhound they actually very very dangerous uh, so if you had a chance mm, kill them first because they take times um, like actually a couple of uh, days to spawn again so um, if you had a chance kill those kill those blue demon mm, those troll troll so uh, this is quite uh, my familiar place i already come here a lot of times so uh, i already farm a lot of items here and as you can see this copper ore already depleted previously so i'm just um, uh, finish it up uh, so yeah, you are going to you are going to use a uh, antler. Uh, obviously, I'm not going to use that because mm, that is old. But antler needs a uh, repair every now and then. So if your base is near uh, around meadows, so around um, uh, black forest uh, near meadows, so you can you have to go come and forth uh, or make two antlers. If you if you can do that, uh, then uh, these skeleton party also invite me for inviting on their house actually so this is also very good this is a crypt i never visit uh, that so rural chambers this is their house name they're very 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 good people uh, and they are just don't they they didn't expect me to come and greet them so i have to go okay my bad so there is a couple of items here uh, and uh, the main thing we're looking for is circling um, circling core that are going to be found in the main uh, main throne main main room actually 
you can also form a lot of um, these um, bone fragment here if you find these kind of um, purple looking glowing stuff you can easily uh, wait and uh, the skeleton is going to uh, spawn and you can collect all those bone fragments and all that so this is a nice place a lot of circling core so these places are very important uh, they provide you a lot of items like these rubies these gold this coin not gold the coin and the location of the next um, uh, next boss so uh, obviously looking for that uh, if you had these kind of these rubies and all that so uh, check out these um, next box location uh, and then you can go searching for another another point or another area uh, you have to go through every place because uh, you may find another circling core uh, like i do so it is um, quite nice to find eight uh, circling cores in one burial chamber and uh, what you have to do is refill your food um, means uh, eat your food properly and uh, then you can also uh, place a fire uh, fireplace uh, inside the burial chamber to get the buff mm, i don't do that but uh, actually you can just um, take your time and complete those uh, burial chamber because those burial chamber gives you circling cores and these circling cores are very very important in the in 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 game actually in in game also you need a lot of portal and a lot of stuff and uh, those items actually need circling cores so uh, circling cores are very important every time if you had a chance to uh, visit those burial chambers go uh, get those uh, go to those burial chamber and get those circling cores uh, th those are very good and black forest actually packed with resources um, like those glowing um, orb and all that so uh, a lot of items is there but i am looking for i already got some uh, tin so uh, already got some copper and uh, i am going for tin uh, if i uh, get some tin here around here around this coastal area i can start creating some uh, bronze so we are looking for these tin and those tins are very easy to uh, easy to get actually very easy so now we come to our humble house uh, it is very um, disoriented place actually so if you already stockpile a couple of logs you can you can do that you, you can come here build your base and then stockpile those um, wood it, you will need it later for this charcoal king and uh, obviously you can easily see uh, because it is on meadows normally it does uh, normally those uh, mobs are not going to attack me uh, that frequently they're going to attack me but not right now because um, i'm just come here after a long time if you just come here and uh, start building or after making these building you can uh, settle for one or two days they are not going to do that but after uh, staying for a long time then then those mobs can come and um, harass you actually they are going to harass you and uh, maybe those two troll can come and um, and the weather is very bad so you you get those circling uh, circling core and uh, go by getting those circling core you can create these two the smelter and these charcoal keen and charcoal keen needs wood if you feed them wood uh, and it gives you charcoal and you feed the uh, char uh, charcoal on the smelter and uh, use those raw ore and uh, get those um, get those items like um, the stuff in got in got sorry i forget so first we have to create a forge here uh, so forge you need six copper so you if you already start uh, collecting copper it is very easy for you because six copper is very easy to get you already collect like one round you can collect like 24 25 copper because copper are heavy so you have to come and for uh, for run 
So six cover is easy and you can cre easily create a forge, one star forge. Uh, next what we need is uh, this bronze plate, uh, so these bronze plate armor and pants. I don't recommend it pre first because you got those, uh, these uh, troll hide. So you can create some troll um, armor and use those uh, bronze or these copper, uh, not copper, but use those bronze for one uh, a pickaxe and another is an axe. If you get a bronze axe, then you can chop down those um, um, white trim. You, you know what, what I'm talking about, then you get the fine wood. So uh, first of all, create three things one pickaxe one axe uh, and one mace and if you if you like a, a shield you can create a shield so these these are the four items what you need uh, at first at bronze age so after unlocking bronze mace uh, pickaxe axe and uh, shield those are your best friend right now you don't need uh, armor and all that because uh, troll cap uh, or the troll um, armor can give you a, um, quite bit of production. So upgrade your weapon. I'm going to show you how to upgrade your armor. So I don't need weapon right now. So you collect those uh, wood, you feed those wood, you feed then you know, the um, smelter and you, it's quite good. You can collect those um, um, like how many I think I had like okay quite good number of uh, items we already collect and um, we can just right now we can create uh, bronze so this is quite good process and as you can see uh, previously I am uh, uh, overweight but not not like I'm I am carrying extra weight but now I'm not carrying extra weight because the conversion actually to three is uh, three is to one, so uh, two copper, one tin becomes one bronze. So it likes uh, one third of the um, uh, weight. So it's actually save you extra, extra, um, extra um, not extra run, come and forth from your home or the main base. So you can easily. Create a uh, create these kind of uh, temporary uh, like um, forging area. You can upgrade those forging area. I'm going to show you all that. So just drop those out and collect those and uh, feed those charcoal. So because I, we had we already in between that video we um, got some hidden cut and between those hidden cut we got some. Uh, ore from those um, area and you are going to use those ore so again uh, we start uh, creating bronze uh, bronze is very essential in this part of the game because uh, fully upgraded bronze actually uh, actually very good armor piece and weapon piece and those weapon actually unlock a lot of stuff so this is quite good and um, uh, I'm going to show you some uh, that armor creation. So what we need is uh, we already got some bronze, uh, but we need some uh, deer leather. So go find some deer leather. So hunting time, greenery and all that. You can just do that because you are on meadows. So you can just uh, go and find some deer. You can kill or chop some tree. You can do it here easily. You don't have to worry about uh, those um, huge number of mobs around the um, around the black forest. So we get some uh, deer leather, I think, and some juicy meat. So quite nice and antler also. So uh, nice. We come back here or we come back to the main area so we start crafting our first uh, item our bronze item so pant and shard so we crafted that <coughs> and you can also craft that um, if you wish to um, 
then uh, we are going to order those items because those um, items looks good actually i'm going to unbrace so don't pick uh, no 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 don't look at me i am getting unrest so nice body okay yes go outside yes now what are those <clears throat> so quite nice uh, very fitting uh, yeah uh, nice metallic touch so uh, you easily understand that uh, bronze is uh, very very good you, you can craft um, a lot of item here you can craft uh, uh, armor set total armor set total weapon set and all that but before that i'm going to show you uh, that if you if you already uh, use those bronze and uh, make up uh, axe then you can uh, do, then you can cut uh, cut down these uh, white tree actually these uh, this tree is going to give you uh, this fine wood version so this fine wood actually uh, very important because these fine woods uh, allow you to create uh, create this uh, portal obviously you don't have portal previously because uh, you, you just unlock all those items here but if you already uh, collect those items you can po you can create a portal like this one uh, i'm going to show you so you make a portal name it uh, name your portal and you have to go back to your main base and uh, place a portal and name the same name as you given him given it uh, right now so those portal get connected i already had a por like blank portal not all more xyz portal so that's already connected so what do we need again these we have to upgrade our forge uh, for uh, upgrading our weapon and armor and all that so for upgrading uh, these forge we uh, we need a couple of times or a couple of things some of those are very easy like copper uh, that is very easy to get you can just go there and uh, find some copper so where we can easily do that we uh, get it and place it right here uh, so our forge became uh, rank 2 so this is quite good and uh, after doing that we can just use some uh, bronze and upgrade our stuff so so lucky I, I think we had some yes we had tin and copper so we can craft Also, the copper uh, copper nail actually uh, oh, copper nail. Also, the nails also actually allow you to use a boat uh, if you if you cannot uh, or if you doesn't have any uh, boat previously, you can create a boat right now. So, and uh, some of those record Iron Age up to uh, up to Iron Age, you cannot uh, create those items like iron and stone cutting table you need but some of those are recovered like another one another piece record uh, copper so we are going to use or we are going to create that one to upgrade our forge to a rank 3 forge uh, so we can craft a higher grade item or upgrade it upgrade those item in a higher grade so after getting some copper and after getting some um, um oh, i think my i am over it yes yes drop those coal now i can please this one uh, inside is very crowded so i have to go outside you have to place it uh, around um, the fort so um, outside the outside the fence or not outside the fence but uh, outside the house also also eligible but uh, keep remember the um, remember the distance distance shouldn't be uh, quite long so now you can see our forge is three third level or we can easily upgrade after getting some uh, bronze so it is very easy to uh, easy to manage at bronze J. Um, you can you can craft items here you can upgrade those items here 
up to certain amount actually so after doing that um, you can just uh, go to sleep and uh, when you are ready those uh, tin ore and copper are going to uh, are already prepared and you, those charcoals are also also prepared so so sleeping is very good and obviously go to sleep every now and then uh, so for 27 days a long long time we play the game so um, now we can go back at a, at our home because I already um, already complete our stuff and uh, before doing that always remember that you already uh, spend a lot of uh, um, items here like uh, for creating forge you already use copper creating those other two upgrade uh, you also create some copper or you spend some copper so before go to your main home or main base uh, remember uh, first uh, destroy those items get those copper back or get those items back and uh, do it for each and every items you had here after completing whole set of your gear and whole set of those um, weapon then i'm going to suggest you do that because because then you have to do it again so uh, preferably uh, spend some time on him make some good fence uh, make a temporary area or temporary life around these black forest will going to help you tremendously black forest is actually very important uh, for this first part of the gameplay and because uh, uh, because uh, mining and chopping down these uh, harder tree uh, pickaxe and all that items and uh, these uh, portal these uh, charcoal keen everything is unlocked within this time period so after that it is not that dramatic actually so um, spend a couple of long times uh, on the um, on black forest uh, collect those goods uh, those friends actually come to say farewell farewell my friend you come visit me yes go bye bye so you come uh, you collect those stuff you uh, you stock those stuff and uh, always remember get those uh, get those um, circling cores because circling cores are important very very important in later games so collect as many um, as many as you can actually so um, so that's it um, have nothing to say anymore you can go to your main home now after completing all those weapon and armor and upgraded those to level 2 i think so after upgrading all those armor and all those things you can go kill those uh, kill that uh, tree monster or this elder or you can just go home and then you can come back later on day so that is the whole guide for black forest it is not a huge thing but actually this black forest is very important so remember shuttling cores copper bronze and tin tin doesn't need that much but copper is very much needed for all our, all all upgrade i think and a lot of up upgrade and um, uh, bronze uh, armor weapon need upgrade so create those upgrade station or upgrade those uh, force station and make those upgrade on the go means on your sub base uh, make your whole make your whole armor weapon and all that then you can just move around uh, just, just go to your main home so bye bye thank you if you like this video hit the like button if you if you wish to subscribe i don't know you can do that also it is free now yes it is free now previously it is not free i think so bye see you next time with a new exciting video